back in the gray car. Heck yeah, man. It's been a minute. I hadn't been driving this car. I've been fixing some things on it. The clear coat went bad on the trunk, so I had that repainted. Fixing some stuff on the front, replacing some headlight bulbs. I ordered the wrong bulb, so now I'm driving the car with no bumper. So I've only been driving the car in the country, so nobody sees it with no bumper. Although, it's embarrassing. It's like driving around with your pants off or something. I, I don't know. Anyway, this whole video, listen, I was in the gym this morning. Always, always, always trying to find inspiration. Listening to a, a podcast about money. Totally unrelated to uh, the topic that, I'm, that I'll get into in just a second. Anyway, I, I was leaving out and I was checking some Facebook notifications and it showed me a post I made about a year ago the day before my grandmother's passing it said someone is almost out of time and you're wasting yours and that someone was my grandmother because her life was a day from being over and I felt guilty for wasting a second because time is the most valuable thing that we have and each day that goes by is one day less that we have to go and get it. People don't understand. Like, I, you know, it's not the most positive thing to sit around and think about death, but somebody is out of time right now. And you're sitting wasting yours. Like you got plenty of it. <laughs> it doesn't make sense to me, right? There's something you want to do with your life and you're not doing it like you got all the time in the world and somebody else is taking their last breath. I just wanted to put that in perspective for you. I hope it helps. Much love. I'm on the ground, hard work really pays off. Until the day it does, I ain't taking no days off. I'm never stopping, you know I'm a stay committed.